So good morning, uh, my name is Iris. Uh, I'm the executive director of Willis Ford Conservancy. And this morning we are in Willis Ford Conservancy's, uh, what we call our native plant demonstration garden. And uh, so what we wanted to create, um, basically not a design space, but almost like a catalog of native plants. Um, so our residents could, or anybody actually coming to our farm stand could just walk through and um, see native plants basically um, in the planting bed and um, maybe decide if that's something that they want to put in their home garden. So uh, you can see like we have an arrangement of native plants. And so Willis Ford Conservancy, our, our main mission is to manage about 2,000 acres of natural open space. And so most of what we have are like meadows and forests and wetlands. Um, but we also uh, support the residential community of Willis Ford, and that's going to be over 2,000 homes. And uh, for us, it's really important uh, to help the residents understand that what they do in their own home gardens is, as, is equally as important um, to uh, habitat maintenance and to supporting wildlife as is what we do in our native open space, uh, our natural open space. So that's why uh, we are creating educational programs. We have the native demonstration garden here uh, to help basically uh, help residents uh, learn how to garden with native plants. And um, so this garden was planted last year, so it's still fairly new. And so you can see there are a few gaps and what we're hoping is over time uh, to fill in. Uh, we're hoping to also add some small native shrubs uh, that, that residents can select from. And, um, you know, maybe also showcase some design ideas and plant combinations. But uh, and the other thing you can see is it's a very sunny garden. So all the plants you see in here are, are basically adapted to, to uh, full sun. And obviously there are a whole range of native plants for shade gardens that we are, we're not able to showcase right here. And um, so in addition to having the native plant garden, uh, we also try to provide educational opportunities. Like we have hosted Landscape for Life a few times. Uh, we just had a container gardening with native plants. Um, so to help residents understand if you don't have a full garden, you can certainly put native plants in containers. They're really well adapted. Uh, we have lectures, uh, we have uh, plant walks, so we have a wide range of opportunities that residents can learn from. Okay.